As more people receive their COVID vaccine, doctors remind every one of us that feeling pretty run down the next day simply shows that your immune system is working. But what about those folks who don't get any side effects? Is the vaccine working for them? New at 11, CBS 17's Maggie Newland is live and getting those answers for us tonight. It's a very good question, Maggie. Brad, I know among my family and friends, and maybe yours too, there have been all kinds of different responses to the shot. Some people have fever and aches. Some people feel nothing at all. So I wanted to find out how different people can have such different reactions to the same vaccines. After a COVID shot, it's not uncommon to get a headache, feel tired or achy, especially after the second dose. UNC infectious disease expert Dr. David Wool says for most people, including him, side effects don't last long. Or like me, you felt like you were getting the flu for, you know, half a day and then you woke up the next day and you were fine. But if side effects show a good immune response, what about people who don't get them? You don't feel bad if you didn't have the side effect. You look just like a lot of the people who were in the trial and didn't get COVID. Dr. Wool says the vaccines protected people whether or not they had side effects. What would be different about someone's immune system that would cause one person to get side effects and one person not? So the immune system system, of course, is something we don't see, so it's hard for us to picture it. But everyone's immune system is as different as the differences between the way we look. And so my immune system may react completely differently to a stimulation than your immune system. Whether or not you experience symptoms after the shots, the goal is teaching your immune system to protect you from severe symptoms if you're exposed to the coronavirus after you're vaccinated. You've primed your body the first time. The second time, you're going to really respond to it. And the third time, it's already circulating. It, it's going to nip it in the bud. It's not even going to let it get as far as it got with the second dose. So your body is being trained to do better and better and better at dealing with this infection. And while we see a whole range of different reactions, one thing doctors say they are seeing pretty commonly is that people are having a stronger reaction, particularly to the first shot, if they have been infected with COVID before, even if they may not realize they were infected. Reporting live in Raleigh, Maggie Newland, CBS 17 News. All right, Maggie, thank you.